Hey, man. Was that uh, day by day? Day by day and with each passing moment. Oh, I'll tell you what. How many of you believe that God is the God of big things? He certainly is. But what I've had to learn, and it's taken me 62 and a half years, and I'm thinking, I'm, I don't know if I learned it yet. He's also the God of the small things. You know, and, and, and there's that saying that said, you know, just d d d don't sweat the small things. Or don't sweat the big things. Worry about the small things. But then I had to realize that pretty well everything is small in God's eyes because he's got it all figured out. And there's that. There's this one part of this, 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 this title of the song. Just little as much when God is in it. And I'm reminded, of course, of Florence. But the, 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 the widow's mites, as a child, that story always just grasped me. How Jesus saw the rich men, and they would walk up there, and literally the, 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 the offering yearns, or whatever, what do you want to call them, were designed in such a way that if you, if you threw your coins, they could go whoosh, whoosh, and they'd make a lot of noise. And so those people would go up there and they would make a lot of noise. If you've ever been to Vegas, I don't mind, recommend going, but you, you play those slots, and I've done it, you know, and, and those, those, those coins come out and they make a lot of noise. In fact, I don't know if you realize or not, the noise they make is F sharp. That's the, that's the tone they make is an F sharp because that's, that's, that's a pleasing noise. They want to attract you. But picture this. The widow's might. She walks up and she puts in, I think it said two pence, which best we can figure is about a fourth of a penny. The, the two pence she had was a fourth of a penny. She didn't even give a penny. And I can, I can, I can, I can picture her, you know, covered because she's embarrassed that this is all she has to give. But you understand, this is all she has. There was rejoicing and noise in heaven. I believe so because Jesus called her out. How would you like to drop that in there and have Jesus say, Oh, you're not getting away so easy. You see, I see what you did. Each and every one of you in this church, you consistently do little things. And see, Satan will try to convince you that what you're doing is of no effect and it's minuscule. But you see, Kathy, if you do that little small thing and we are, we are in that crown, there's a crown and you can win it if you go in Jesus' name. Little as much. In the harvest field now ripened, there's a work for all to do. Hark, the voice of God is calling to the harvest, calling you. Little is much when God is in it. Labor not for wealth or fame. There's a crown and you can win it if you go in Jesus' name. Does the place you're called to labor seem so small and little known? It is great if God is in it and he'll not forget his own. Little is much when God is in it. Labor not for wealth or fame. There's a crown and you can win it if you go in Jesus' name. When the conflict here is ended and our race on earth is run, he will say, if we are faithful, welcome home, my child, well done. Little is much when God is in it. Labor not for 
wealth or fame there's a crown and you can win it if you go in Jesus name when we enter heaven's portals and our Savior's face we see cares of life will all be forgotten we'll be happy glad and free little is much when God is in it labor not for wealth or fame there's a crown and you can win it if you go in Jesus name amen amen thank you